meditate with me on a Tuesday. And today this meditation is actually a kind of a quantum leap or an evolutionary leap. And we know this is all about going within. And we know it's all about us knowing that what we're doing within the inner journey, the inner realizations, the inner peace, the inner power, the inner magic is actually creating our new earth. And so I'm inviting you today on this journey to make this evolutionary leap, stepping out of the fear of death, stepping out of the obstacles and the mindsets and the paradigms that hold you back from truly being you and come into that beautiful cycle that is always present in nature, giving birth, living, dying and rebirthing and being really in harmony with that beautiful cycle. And it's going to be fun, of course, because you're going to meet you in, in a very different way. And let's see who is coming through to join us on this evolutionary leap. So just get yourself ready. Find a space to sit or to lie down, whatever resonates with you. And just close your eyes and tune in to you, to your heart. And you want to breathe in now, put your hand on the heart, inhale deeply into the heart and connect and release. Inhale into your diaphragm and let it swell your chest now into the heart, connect and exhale. And again, inhaling, holding into your heart, connect and exhale. And you can feel your beautiful heart light surrounding you now. And in that space, in that light, you're making this evolutionary leap to the natural cycles, to the harmony of birth, living, dying, and rebirthing. And that leap is taking you to your ascended you, to that one who is already in harmony. So you imagine yourself now being at a mountain and looking down. See all the beauty that is below you. I know when you jump, when you leap, takes you into your evolutionary self, into that self that is already harm in harmony with the true cycles of life, of the cosmos, and all there is. So it's time to leap. So meet yourself in that ascended state 
already in harmony with the cycles of the cosmos, the cycles of life, the cycles of this earth, and especially the aspect of rebirth. Notice yourself here in this evolved and ascended state is laughing, is light, is playful. And allow yourself to relax into an embrace with yourself here. Totally surrendering and embracing these cycles, these rhythms, of all there is. And as you are falling into this embrace with yourself and these natural rhythms, notice you are receiving messages now and signs from Rumi about the heart, about you being the ocean and the drop, about you being in those fields beyond where you can see and dance to those rhythms of love and the heart. attuned to these beautiful rhythms, the rhythms of evolution, of life, of ascension, and the rhythms of your own heart. And notice there is no more separation between you and your ascended, your evolved self. You have become one. As you are able to access consciously by your choice a six dimensional state, free from the limitations of the third, the fourth, and even the fifth, as you are more conscious and aware all the 12 dimensions that you have access to and for some of you even beyond. And so take back these rhythms, take back the wisdom of Rumi and your evolved and ascended self in the perfect harmony 
of the true life, of true evolution, of true ascension. Knowing we are all in the state of rebirthing. And here now is coming to you, the Phoenix. As she will be your guide too on this journey of rebirthing. And so just bring yourself back into the here and now. Bring yourself back into your breath. Notice that light around you is always there. It's just for you to be aware. It's just for you to care. You can hold this presence in that state of the sixth dimension. You can hold this presence and be fully here. And so open your eyes and smile. Yes, very curious how this evolutionary leaping was for you, the experience with Rumi, and of course the experience with your evolved and ascended self. How does it feel? How are the rhythms of rebirthing? that we are all in at this moment. Please share, subscribe, like, all these other good things and be part of the community. And see you soon. Much love from my heart to yours.